think they would mind if I knit some socks right off their back? Hello, my moon pies. It's your Mima. And today, let's talk about layered scenes or those cutout scenes where the face ring character is actually embedded into the picture. This is going to be our final product and the scene that we'll use to demonstrate it. So let's dissect it piece by piece and put it back together. Let's take our picture. I'm using GIMP because, well, it's free. <laughs> take your free select tool and start outlining the area that we want to cut out and make transparent. Once you connect them, add a transparent layer by adding an alpha channel. Then edit and clear that section. Bam! <laughs> and then export it as a PNG so it keeps that transparency. We have two pictures now, the original and the one we cut out. In this example, I took out the entire top portion. Let's take them and start layering. And that's where the magic happens. We're going to add the whole image, which is the image without the, without the hole. Let's name it background. Be sure to check the unload image when not showing to decrease the usage on your OBS CPU usage. Add your file. Now let's add face rig. Size it and put it in the proximate position. You can always adjust it later. That's a good looking rig right there. Now we're going to add the one that we cut out over top of it to make it appear that I'm sitting behind the desk. See? The magic is in the layering. You have to have them correctly layered in OBS. Make sure you start with the background on the bottom, then face rig, and then the picture with the hole on the top. It's just that easy to add yourself into the scene, literally. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And for more face rig magic and to see it in action, visit us on Twitch, live, Monday through Friday, 7 p.m. Eastern Time at twitch.tv, me, Ma, the Geeky Granny. And don't forget, you now hold the key to the magic. On a cold day, there's nothing like some waffles. I'm a catfish. Get it?